Good thing because Jennifer Burns is in the Fox 13 Cafe making ginger lime chicken skewers and she has a guest with her. So Dan's excited about the appetizers, Jen. I'm excited to show them. And yes, I do. I have Hannah here who is a cardiologist with Intermountain Medical Center with the Heart Institute. Thanks for coming and cooking with me. Of course, looking forward to it. Okay, so what we're doing today, the, chill, the, the lime uh, chicken skewers. And while I kind of start this off with our marinade, tell us why, in your opinion, why is it better for us to eat, not eat as much red meat and the chicken? Tell us, you know, from a heart perspective. Well, really, that's part of a Mediterranean diet. What a Mediterranean diet is, is high in fruits and vegetables. Okay. And then your protein sources are mainly fish and chicken. And then red meat is used, but it's used sparingly, say once, okay. maybe twice a week. And what they found is that people that follow a Mediterranean diet actually have lower risks of cardiovascular disease. So it's excellent okay. to have fabulous chicken recipes that you enjoy cooking and that are easy to make. I love this one too. This actually came out of the cookbook that's going to be given out at upcoming Heart Fair. This this particular recipe. So I'm excited to try this one. I tested it out the other day. So what we're doing here is we actually just have lots of the lime juice here. Now this is ginger. Ginger mm -hmm. I feel is so flavorful and so good for us. And what I found, Hannah, and you got to tell me uh, from your experience, if you flavor your food really well with the spices or like fresh ginger and the limes and stuff, you don't need to add so much of the salt and the sodium. That's so true. Salt is such a large contributor to high blood pressure. Most Americans don't even realize how much salt that they're getting in their diet, yeah. whether it's just from canned foods where they're not even thinking about it. And then there's a lot of added salt, especially if you go out to eat. There's a lot of salt in the food at restaurants. And even things you don't think about, like bread sometimes, too. Mm -hmm. Okay, what we have so far is we I cut up some uh, fresh garlic there. Go ahead and pour in. This is now low sodium soy sauce. Perfect. Get some of that in there. I know you'd be a big fan of that. A little bit of heat. We're going to get in some red crushed pepper. Now you're going to be talking on February 9th at the upcoming Heart Fair at Intermountain Medical Center. What are you going to be talking about? That's correct. My topic is how do you know if you have a healthy heart? So basically, I'll be discussing risk factors for atherosclerosis, which is one of the leading factors behind the development of cardiovascular disease, and what you need to know to make sure that you have a healthy heart now and into the future. Oh, that's great. I mean, and people can ask questions and stuff like that. Definitely. Okay. So I will be doing a talk along with one of my other colleagues who's also a cardiologist at the medical center. Doctors will be around all day. There's EKGs that we will do and interpret for free and other activities for the family as well. Oh, I love that. Okay. Now, last I added just some uh, red crush, crushed pepper. Put it in here. We're going to marinate this up. When we come back on the next segment, will you help me out for some that I already have marinated, putting the skewers in? Sounds good. I can do that. Okay. All right, we'll get the skewers and the chicken. I've got my uh, indoor grill here already up to a pretty high heat. Going to get it oiled up. We'll start in on the chicken. And guys, we're going to bring some skewers of the chicken <laughs> in after the next segment for you to try because I'm excited to try this one. One more thing, we're going to add a little bit of that ginger, though. Well, if they're good for us. It's good for All you. All right. <laughs> Perfect. Then we'll no yeah. no <laughs> Thanks, Jen. If you want the full recipe, visit fox13now.com and search chicken skewers. We'll be right now with Maybe some ginger, some lime, chicken. <laughs> and Jennifer Burns, who's in the Fox 13 Cafe, making what I just mentioned. Okay. Jennifer? I wish you could smell it, Dan and Carrie. It smells so good in here. My goodness. Indoor grilling. I'm here with Hannah from Intermountain Medical Center, Heart Institute. Thanks for coming and cooking with me. It's been a ton of fun. <laughs> and it does smell good in here. You have to verify. Oh, it's wonderful. <laughs> That's what we just finished up there the, with the, uh, the lime juice, um, and we got some of the ginger in there, fresh garlic, red crushed pepper. We use Mrs. Dash instead of salt, and then a low sodium soy sauce, a little pepper, and some canola oil. Now tell me, Hannah, being a cardiologist, why? tell me about the suggested oils that people should be cooking with. So canola oil is a fabulous choice, and the reason why is it's high in omega-3 fatty acids. Okay. Omega-3s have a lot of benefits for your health. They can help lower the fats in your blood, also known as triglycerides, by 20 to 30 percent. Wow. They can raise your good cholesterol, the HDL, by several points, and they can even sh lower blood pressure by a few points in some studies, and so they have a lot of benefits. They're also anti-inflammatory. Okay, so a big difference in what you're choosing and when to cook oils with, or which one. Exactly. Olive oil is also a good choice as well. I use that one quite a bit. You want to mm -hmm. help me? We'll put some fresh lime right at the end while they're hot, coming off the grill there. And I think those probably took us probably about four or five minutes on each side because they're quite 
thin there. Now the upcoming heart fair, I'm excited because I'm going to be doing a cooking demo um, at Intermount Medical Center in Murray at noon and you're going to be uh, doing a little talk, And but there's free screenings as well, right? Yes, in addition to all the educational presentations that will be going on throughout the day, we have screenings for blood pressure, cholesterol, glucose, body fat, and then as I mentioned earlier, free EKGs. And there'll be physicians there on site to talk with you about your right. test results and what should be done about them. Everyone needs to take care of themselves and be doing the screenings, I'd say. Definitely, and it makes it easy because it's on a Saturday where a lot of people are off of work. So it's, if it's difficult for you to get in and see a primary care physician or a cardiologist during the week, you can take this opportunity and come to the heart fair. Oh, that's a great idea for the Saturday. Now, can I, I offer you a chicken skewer that looks like a lollipop here? Mm, that looks <laughs> wonderful. Okay, we'll have to give a little taste here. Mmm, such flavor. Really good. And only Mrs. Dash, no salt. I love that. Guys, bring us some of the lollipop chicken skewers in for you, too. <laughs> but we're excited. We'll eat them. Boy, those you know are who good. else would probably eat them? Wonderful. Next We've got a Fox <laughs> Best Friend who's sitting here just waiting for a treat. But if you want to, if you want to do it at your house, just go to our website, foxfortynow.com, and search for chicken skewers. Are you saying Toby, our Fox Best friend, would love some chicken? Don't you think? I think so. Chris, don't you think he'd like some chicken? <laughs> yeah, he yeah. would Is like his some chicken. Maybe that's why he's so 